let's go back all the way to the beginning where God created the heavens and the earth, right? God created the heavens and the earth, and he said, it is good. And then, and then he separated the sky from the water. And he looked at the sky and the water, and he said, it is what? Good. Right, you're going to play along with this. We're going to keep going, all right? Then he created all the stars in the sky, all the planets, everything. He looked at all of it, and he said, it's what? Good. There you go, now we're getting there, all right? So then he said, all the oceans, all the animals can be in the oceans. All the birds and the, and the creatures in the sky will fly up there. And it's what? Good. And then he created all the animals in the land. He said, the plants and vegetation, to all the animals. And he said, it was what? Good. And then he came to man, and he said, I can do one better. I'm going to create somebody in my own image. I'm going I'm to breathe life into this person. And, and, and he's going to live and survive. He's going to take care of all these things. And he looked at it and he said, it's what? Good. It's not good. It's not good. Look at Genesis 2.18. I want us to read this verse out loud together. The Lord said, it is what? Not good. Not good for man to be what? Alone. It's not good for man to be alone. Think about this. Man wasn't alone. He had God. He had God in perfect harmony, without sin. All of creation had not yet been subjugated to the sin, that corruption that is, is today. Animals living in perfect harmony. He had everything around him. And God took a look at that after he created the entire universe. And he said, one thing is not good. It's not good for what? For man, to be alone. man to be alone. Friends, I've heard it said that all I need is me and Jesus. I just need me and Jesus. That's so all I got. If I got me and Jesus, I'm okay. I don't need to be part of a church. I just got me and Jesus. Okay, I want you to take your CFL for a minute. I want you to flip it over in the back. Okay, on the back side of your CFL, we list what we call our five purposes. That's who we are as a church. Okay, and, and on the back side of it, the first one says we are designed for five things. First one is we're designed for a relationship with who? Yeah, with him. That's first. We always need to have a relationship with God. But the second thing we're designed for is what? Relationship with others. We need to have people in our lives. And God recognized that. We need to have significant human relations with other people.